Hey guys, today we're going to show you how to edit your text and change your images if you're using the page builder through Elegant Themes. So you want to go to your dashboard, you want to go to pages, and then you want to go to the page that you want to modify. So we'll go to the home page here. So the home page we were on, we had our full width header, which had the text in it. And then here you can see that we've labeled the next section what we want it to be. So we have text and then images. So if we want to change the text, you click the three lines here. And then you want to scroll down to the text itself. So here you can see we have a bunch of text. We can change the words. We can change the spacing. We can change the alignment. It's all a WYSIWYG editor, or what you see is what you get. So you can go through and change everything there, and then you click Save. And then you can go to Image. Again, you want to click the three lines. That's the Edit button. And again, we have more things that we can change here. So we can upload a new image by clicking Upload New Image, or if we wanted to just remove the image, we could delete the text, and it changes the preview. We can add Alt Text, which gives search engines an idea of what that image is, just because they don't know what an image is so if you fill out the alt text it can help with your SEO ranking just because it tells what that image is again we would hit save once we've changed the image so we don't want to do that then you can preview the changes by clicking preview it'll open up a new tab so you can see what the changes were so in this case if we go and we change our text if we just completely remove it all click save we can click preview it will reload the page that was already loaded and you can see that the text is gone if we change our mind you can just click pages again and it will say you're navigating away are you sure you want to in this case we do because we don't want it to save those changes so yes leave the page go back to the home page and then you can go down to text again and see that it's all back you can also see here that you have some revisions so you can go through and browse those revisions and possibly put those back. It's a little harder to read because it does actually put it in short codes and different things, but you can understand what it is saying. So you can see that we have our full width section, and you can have the title there, and then you've got another section here with a row. So it is a little harder to read, but you can go back to those if you need to. So that's how you edit the images and the text inside of your page builder setup. So then once you have made all those changes and done everything that you want to, you just click update and it will update the page to your live site. If you have questions on how to do something, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more.